Subscribe Dazzlers! Welcome back to Daz Games and another Daz Watches! <clears throat> I got a bit of a sore throat, I apologise for the scratchiness. First of all guys, I had a shave. Babyface Daz is back. Second of all, the channel finally got verified. Yay! Look at that. Little grey tick means everything. It means I'm famous now. I'm absolutely famous. All worship me because I'm verified. Been a long time since um, we started this channel, so yeah, I, I guess YouTube have recognised my efforts. You know when you're a small fish in a big pond and you're splashing around the bigger koi? You gotta fight for your share. Don't know what that was. <laughs> Today guys, we are going to be watching a video based off the My Strange Addiction series. We've done videos like this before and they are weird. This one is called My Strange Addiction Choose Dirty Diapers. I'm refusing. I'm refusing to believe that this is real. No one can be like this. This is not what I've got in my head. I, I'm pretty damn sure of it. Let's watch the video. My name is Keisha, and I'm expecting my first child, and I love sniffing and chewing dirty diapers. Yep. Yep. It is worse than I previously thought. How can you say that to camera? Knowing you've got a child on the way. Oh my god, is she gonna sniff her child? I, I, I always say it when we react to these things, but why? Why? Or how, rather, did they get into this? How did they discover it? She must have taken one out the trash or something and thought, that smells nice. It has to have pee in it. It has to have pee in it. Of course it does! Try saying that at Subway! You get weird looks! And she hasn't got a kid, so where's she getting these nappies from? We call them nappies here in the UK, it's not diapers. Sorry about the language barrier. The heavier ones that have more pee, smell better. Yeah. Oh god, I feel- I, I actually- no joke, I actually feel like gagging a little bit. Oh. Oh my god, I actually had to swallow that. That is, um, that is a serious gag reflex. Right there. <clears throat> I'm not even joking. What's the matter with this woman?! Mmm. This one's soft. I love it. It just tastes amazing. Take that nappy out your mouth! It's weird! It's weird! Where's her parents? Where's her parents? When did this start? Look at it! She's eating it like a Big Mac! I- I can't believe this is real. I can- I cannot believe this is real. Tastes amazing. I have one while I'm cooking in the kitchen. I have one in my drawers. I have one while I'm sleeping. I keep some in my trunk. I keep some in my pocketbook. No, for real. This is good. <laughs> It's not very often I'm speechless. I usually have a lot to say. Someone needs to fill one of these diapers with holy water and let her smell that. <laughs> okay, continue. Ooh. I find a lot of diapers. Fiance? You kiss that woman? No way does she have a fiance. I'm sorry. Imagine coming home. Oh, honey, you wouldn't believe today. The office was crazy. Linda. Oh. And he's agreed to marry her? He's a fiance? He's not even a boyfriend. He's putting a ring on it. He's putting a ring on it! You are not the weirdest thing, uh, most stressful thing that I'm seeing today. So go away. Like, all over the place. There's a diaper. There's a diaper. Keisha gets most of her diapers from her friend Kim's twins. Kim? Kim? You're enabling her, and it's weird. Maybe she sells them to her. I mean, imagine, like, she, it's pretty hard to get dirty diapers, you know? She could be like, a, she could like, literally make her pay for them. Hurry up, baby's crying. It's very annoying because she doesn't care what time it is. She'll wake my baby up to take the day. Uh, someone slam dunk through those hoops. Jesus Christ. You got a baby and you're wearing those massive hoops. Little, little, um, less known fact, less weird than what you're watching. <laughs> I, when I was younger, during the 90s, it was very trendy and popular to have one piercing in, in your left ear. As soon as my daughter came along and she saw something shiny dangling out my ear and put a finger through it, because her little baby fingers were just the right size to go through it and yank, it was out. It was gone. This woman is wearing Saturn's rings on her ears. They're gonna get ripped out. On the baby. I wanna, I wanna take this one off of her, here. Oh my god, we're she's gonna, gonna cry. We're gonna take this one off. 
Yeah, this Don't sniff her whilst holding her up in the air like some Simba shit! How can you let someone into your home and say, I want that diaper off that baby she's wearing and then she sniffs her? How can you continue to let her in? I don't know. I don't know what's worse. This or that I'm getting honey boo boo adverts in the corner. It's better than low disk space, I suppose. No. Yeah, this, this is where I need to go. She's sleepy. Don't change her diaper right now. She's gonna cry. It's nasty. It's her baby. If she, it's, just tell her. Stop, you weird hoe. Stop it. Stop smelling my baby. Stop stealing the nappies off its back. Stop it. This is getting like out of hand. My addiction to diapers started about three years ago. One of my friends was changing her baby and she gave me the diaper to throw out. And I kept it for like a week and I smelt it like every morning, night. Oh, why though, why? Since the first dirty diaper, she has collected over 25,000 dirty diapers to feed her addiction. 25. Thousand diapers. I can't even contemplate how much shit that is. I. Oh my god. This is ridiculous. Stop throwing my stuff out. Come on. She's even willing to dig in the garbage for her diapers. Come on. I'm gonna smell them just one last time and then you can have them. I'm gonna smell them. I, all jokes aside, and it's very easy to make jokes on this situation, I try not to, but what is the cause? I always watch this, and I try and root out the cause of their strange addiction. I get all therapy on them, you know? Is it literally just the smell that she's addicted to? I find it, I find addictions very interesting because I'm not a very addictive person. I can just stop and start something easy. Last time and then you can have them. No. Please, John. No. I like dirty diapers. That's what I want. That's what I need to have. Dirty diapers. That's what I want. That's what I need to have. The diapers, they decay after a certain time. It'll start to like mold a little bit. Oh, there's flies all of a sudden. Wait, don't let them. Yeah, that's what happens when you keep 25,000 nappies in your house. Put my diapers out. She's almost like a big baby herself, isn't it? Like the way she asks for the diapers. I want my diaper. <laughs> I want to smell them. It's very childlike. Trauma here. I can smell that. Like... At this point, it is a last cause, actually. My name's Keisha, and I'm addicted to chewing on dirty diapers. Oh my god, she's taken it to the bakery! She's taken a dirty diaper to the bakery! And she's smelling it! I'm honestly, I'm not even kidding, holding off being sick. This is a problem for me. The fact that I'm smelling it and then chewing it. Some people don't have a stomach to see anything nasty. So they're just like, oh, this is disgusting. But I need it. I need it. You need to go and see someone. She needs to go see someone. She needs to go see a doctor. Has she ever been? I wonder. <laughs> Hi, guys. Hi. You invited the diaper snipper. Snipper? What's that? <laughs> you invited the diaper sniffer. It's a tongue twister. To a baby shower. This is going to be interesting. Here you go. Yay. I'm excited. Yes, those are cloth diapers. I feel like you need this to help you move forward with your- She doesn't need a different type of diaper to chew on. Have an intervention with the bitch. Like, just sit down and say, Hey, Keisha, it's fucking weird, all right? Here's Dr. Phil. Dr. Phil walks in with his moustache and his bald head and his clipboard. It's like, if you look at this diagram here and here, it shows you're a nasty bitch. You need- you need serious help! Don't buy her diapers! That's, that's enabling it! Your addiction. Are you guys kidding? 
It's weird. It's you have diapers in your pocketbook right now? What do you Maybe mean? I do. This is my travel one. I just travel with this one. Are you willing to lose your fiance because you sniff diapers? Oh, she knew it was coming. She, she, she's very like she's throwing a tantrum now. It's very childlike. I know it's my life, and I'm gonna do what I want to do. So she's not gonna listen to the advice. She's gonna be selfish and sniff crap. Her fiance is a more understanding man than I. I just like sniffing dirty diapers. You can't keep saying that and it'd be okay. Sorry. <laughs> this is an issue. Everybody keeps saying it's an issue. But it's not an issue to me. Tell me, you, you have the diaper. Like I have, I actually had one. So. Oh, she's going to therapy. Okay. All right. Props. Let me see. So you sniff and then you, and, and then, then you I... nibble. Well, how do you feel now that you're about to give birth and have your own supply? I feel great. Man, it ends there. I wish I could see the whole whole thing. Like, I wanted to find out the outcome. Did she stop? Someone tell me if she stopped. All right, guys, so that was uh, My Strange Addictions. I really want to know what happened to this woman. Did she stop? Are her diaper-chewing days over? We watch, some, we watch some stuff on this channel, don't we? We watch some shit on this channel. Like, love, caress my channel. I'm, I'm, I'm actually, I've, I've actually had dreams of blowing my PC up with dynamite, with actual dynamite. It's gonna happen. Th this low disk space thing is gonna come to an end. Like, it, it, one way or another, it's coming to an end. Linda, this is your fault. I'll see you in the next video, guys. Stay dazzling. <laughs> it's just a way for them to be richer but quicker Gives me the fuel that I need for this run to be sicker I'm sick of the shit that they give you